How much do you know about honey badgers, for those who are unaware? Honey badgers, also known as Melivora capensis, are fascinating creatures native to Africa, Southwest Asia, and the Indian subcontinent. They are famous for their fearlessness, toughness, and ferocity, often earning them the nickname, the world's most fearless animal. Physically, honey badgers are compact, muscular mammals with a distinctive appearance. They have a broad head, small eyes, and powerful jaws with sharp teeth. Their fur is coarse and ranges in color from gray to black, often with a distinctive white or light-colored stripe running from their head to the base of their tail. Honey badgers are highly adaptable and thrive in various environments, including forests, grasslands, and deserts. They are primarily carnivorous, feeding on a wide range of prey, including insects, small mammals, birds, reptiles, and even larger animals like antelope and young buffalo. They are also known to scavenge for food, making use of carcasses left behind by other predators. One of the most remarkable aspects of honey badgers is their tenacity and fearlessness. Despite their relatively small size, usually around 9 to 12 kilograms or 20 to 26 pounds, they are known to confront much larger animals, including lions and hyenas when threatened. They have tough, durable skin that provides some protection against bites and stings, and they are capable climbers and diggers, allowing them to escape or find shelter when needed. Overall, honey badgers are intriguing and resilient animals, with a reputation for their boldness and ability to survive in challenging environments. What we can learn from honey badgers. You see, there are some qualities we can learn from honey badgers. Despite being relatively small in size, usually around 9 to 12 kilograms or 20 to 26 pounds, they are known to confront much larger animals, including lions and hyenas when threatened. Honey badgers have the nickname, the world's most fearless animal. I would like to use this analogy to inspire us to be ruthless and courageous when faced with challenges that life throws at us. Now, of course, do not actively seek chaos and trouble, and you should know when to walk away from danger, nor should you go pick fights and chaos just because you wish to show off your fearlessness and courage, that is, neither courage nor fearlessness, that is, being a bully and foolish. You can be fearless too, because ultimately, fear is simply false evidence appearing real. But let's delve deeper into fear and what it represents. Fear is a complex emotional and physiological response to perceived threats or dangers. It's a fundamental aspect of human and animal behavior that serves as a protective mechanism, triggering a series of physiological changes aimed at increasing the chances of survival in the face of perceived danger. At its core, fear involves the recognition of a potential threat or danger, whether real or imagined. This recognition can arise from various stimuli, including specific objects, situations, memories, or even abstract concepts. Once perceived, fear triggers a cascade of responses in both the brain and body, including increased heart rate, heightened alertness, muscle tension, and the release of stress hormones like adrenaline and cortisol. These physiological changes prepare the individual to either confront the threat, fight, or flee from it. Flight, commonly known as the fight or flight response. Fear can vary widely in intensity and duration, ranging from mild unease or apprehension to intense terror or panic. It can also be influenced by factors such as past experiences, cultural influences, individual differences, and the context in which the perceived threat occurs. While fear is often viewed as a negative emotion due to its unpleasant nature, it plays a crucial role in promoting survival by helping individuals recognize and respond to potential dangers in their environment. However, excessive or irrational fear can lead to anxiety disorders and significantly impact an individual's quality of life. The fearlessness of honey badgers is a remarkable trait that stems from a combination of factors, including their physical attributes, behavioral adaptations, and evolutionary history. 1. 
toughness. Honey badgers have exceptionally tough and durable skin, which provides some protection against bites, stings, and scratches from potential predators. This physical resilience allows them to withstand attacks that might incapacitate or deter other animals. 2. Aggression Honey badgers are known for their aggressive nature. When threatened, they are not inclined to flee, but rather to confront their aggressors head-on. Their boldness and willingness to fight back, even against larger predators, contribute to their reputation as fearless animals. 3. Versatility Honey badgers are highly adaptable creatures, capable of thriving in a wide range of environments. Their adaptability allows them to utilize various strategies for survival, whether it involves hunting for prey, scavenging for food, or seeking shelter in different habitats. 4. Intelligence Despite their relatively small size, honey badgers are intelligent animals with keen problem-solving skills. They can assess situations quickly and employ clever tactics to overcome obstacles or threats further enhancing their ability to navigate and survive in challenging environments. 5. Nocturnal Behavior Honey badgers are primarily nocturnal, meaning they are most active during the night. This behavioral adaptation helps them avoid encounters with potential predators and minimizes competition for resources with diurnal species. 6. Lack of predators. In their native habitats, honey badgers often lack natural predators due to their formidable reputation and defensive capabilities. This reduced predation pressure allows them to exhibit more fearless behavior without facing significant consequences. Overall, the fearlessness of honey badgers is a result of a combination of evolutionary adaptations, behavioral traits, and ecological factors that have allowed them to thrive as resilient and formidable predators in their natural habitats. Now let's bring it back to humans and see how we can learn from the qualities that make the honey badger fearless and dominant in its environment. Allow me to emphasize that these suggestions are focused on you as an individual, not others, meaning these qualities have to be developed by you for you and the outer world will not have any effect on you anymore, and you will be in a better position to absorb and deter the chaos the world throws your way. 1. Toughness. As a person, how can you develop toughness? We can divide toughness into mental and physical aspects. Developing mental toughness involves cultivating resilience, perseverance, and a strong mindset to navigate challenges, setbacks, and adversities effectively. One approach is to embrace a growth mindset, which involves viewing challenges as opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. By reframing difficulties as learning experiences, individuals can build resilience and develop the ability to bounce back from setbacks with renewed determination. Additionally, setting realistic goals and maintaining a positive attitude can foster mental toughness by providing a sense of purpose and direction, even in the face of adversity. Developing self-awareness and practicing mindfulness techniques can also help individuals manage stress, regulate emotions, and maintain focus amidst pressure or uncertainty. Another key aspect of building mental toughness is through deliberate practice and exposure to discomfort. By gradually exposing oneself to challenging situations and pushing beyond one's comfort zone, individuals can build resilience and develop confidence in their ability to handle adversity. This process involves embracing discomfort as an opportunity for growth rather than avoiding it, thereby expanding one's capacity to cope with stress and uncertainty. Furthermore, seeking support from mentors, coaches, or peers can provide valuable guidance, encouragement, and accountability in the pursuit of mental toughness. Through consistent effort, reflection, and adaptation, 
Individuals can develop the mental resilience needed to thrive in the face of adversity and achieve their goals. Developing physical toughness involves consistent training, progressive overload, and resilience building practices. Regular physical exercise, including strength training, cardiovascular conditioning, and flexibility exercises, helps build physical resilience by strengthening muscles, bones, and cardiovascular health, gradually increasing the intensity and duration of workouts through progressive overload challenges, the body to adapt and become stronger over time. Additionally, incorporating activities that test endurance, such as long-distance running or high-intensity interval training, can build mental fortitude and teach individuals to push through physical discomfort. Embracing a mindset of perseverance and determination during workouts, as well as when facing physical challenges in everyday life, fosters the development of physical toughness, seminally, prioritizing recovery and self-care, including adequate sleep, nutrition, and stress management techniques, is essential for sustaining physical resilience and preventing injury. 2. Healthy Aggression as an individual, developing healthy aggression involves constructively channeling assertiveness and determination while maintaining self-control and respect for others. One approach is to set clear goals and develop a strategic plan to achieve them, allowing you to direct your energy and focus toward productive endeavors. Embrace challenges as opportunities for growth, viewing setbacks as temporary obstacles rather than insurmountable barriers. Cultivate a mindset of resilience and determination, recognizing that persistence and effort are essential for success. Additionally, practice assertive communication, expressing your needs and boundaries confidently while respecting the rights and perspectives of others. Seek feedback from mentors or peers to gain insights into areas for improvement and refine your approach over time. Remember to prioritize self-care and manage stress effectively, as maintaining balance and perspective is crucial for sustaining healthy aggression in the long term. 3. Versatility As an individual, developing versatility involves cultivating a mindset of adaptability, open-mindedness, and willingness to learn new skills or explore different approaches. Start by expanding your knowledge and experiences through diverse learning opportunities such as reading books on various subjects, taking courses outside your usual areas of interest, or engaging in activities that challenge your existing abilities. Embrace change as an opportunity for growth rather than a threat, and actively seek out new experiences or challenges that push you outside your comfort zone. Practice flexibility in your thinking and problem solving, considering multiple perspectives and approaches to tackle tasks or overcome obstacles. Cultivate resilience by viewing setbacks as opportunities to learn and adapt, rather than signs of failure. Finally, maintain an attitude of curiosity and openness to new ideas, recognizing that versatility comes from a willingness to explore and evolve. 4. Intelligence Developing intelligence as an individual involves a combination of cognitive stimulation, continuous learning, and effective strategies for problem solving. To start, engage in activities that challenge your mind, such as puzzles, brain games, or learning a new language or instrument. Reading widely across various subjects and staying informed about current events can also stimulate cognitive growth. Seek out opportunities for lifelong learning, whether through formal education, online courses, workshops, or seminars to expand your knowledge and skill set. Practice critical thinking by analyzing information, questioning assumptions, and evaluating evidence to develop a deeper understanding of complex concepts. Additionally, cultivate creativity by exploring new ideas, experimenting with different approaches, and embracing failure as a stepping stone to innovation. Finally, prioritize mental and physical well-being as a healthy lifestyle supports cognitive function and overall brain health. 5. Nocturnal Behavior In the context of humans, 
We can translate this to mean to know and play to our strengths, know what we are good at, and invest in it wholeheartedly. Hope these lessons add value to you. The honey badger is truly a fascinating animal that we, as individuals, can learn from. I wish you all success.